Right, so the second example, we're going to solve the following simultaneous equation graphically. y is equal to minus 5 over 3x plus 7, and 2x plus 3y is equal to 12, using the GDC. So if we just write out the two equations first, so it's y is equal to 5 over 3x plus 7, and 2x plus 3y is equal to 12, and go directly to our GDC. We're going for a graphing mode, so click select graphing mode. Write in the first one, so just write in minus 5 divided by 3x plus 7. Enter. Just going to move the cursor slightly over to there. The second one, 2x plus 3y is equal to 12, is a relation, so we can't use the um, function method, so in order to enter it we need to go to menu, graph entry edit and put in relation and then put in 2x plus 3y is equal to 12 press enter and we've got the other one there, just going to move the label out slightly the way we are interested in the point of intersection so in order to do that we just do menu analyze the graph intersection Lower bank bound means that we move it slightly to the left of the point of intersection and press enter. And then to the right, press enter, and we get the point of intersection 3, 2. So there's just one screenshot of the final thing because we've already shown you the method in a previous video. In order to show the examiner, you need to draw a sketch of it now. So draw a set of axes. It should be drawn with a ruler labelled X and Y. Mark on the first graph. Okay, it would just be a sketch, so just put it roughly in the right position. Though I am using the squares here. Label it at one end, Y is equal to minus 5 over 3X plus 7. Mark on the second one. Label it 2X plus 3Y is equal to 12. Mark on the point of intersection. This is 3 and this is 2 from the calculator, and then finally write down x is equal to 3, y is equal to 2. Please make your sketch as large as possible so that the examiner can clearly see what you have, uh, have written down.